Hey guys, so I don't know if you've ever tried transferring data over from an Android device to an iPhone. So if you're switching from Android to iOS, transferring pictures, messages, emails, attachments, voice memos, bookmarks, all that stuff sometimes can be hard because sometimes the Android app isn't really compatible properly with the iOS version. It's just a broken process. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can transfer over 30 types of different data types from an older iPhone to a new iPhone or from an Android device over to an iPhone. So let's just get right into this video. So the process is fairly simple. Of course, you need both devices. I have an iPhone SE over to an iPhone 13 Pro Max, but as I mentioned, this also works the same way for Android devices. Links will be in the description for the software. Any trans, a long time partner of the channel, it's a free application to download, try it out. So you wanna go to phone switcher after you back up, and as you can see from this screen here, you can connect an Android device and send the data over to an iPhone. Now I'm gonna use an older iPhone here, the SE, and I'm upgrading over to the 13 Pro Max. So once I connect both devices, the software will recognize here and you'll see that momentarily we get iPhone SE here on the left and the recipient device, which will be the iPhone 13 Pro Max, as you can see right here. Now, once both devices are connected and recognized, you wanna make sure you click the next option here and this will show you all the data that can be transferred from the older device, the iPhone SE or the Android device, whichever device you're using, over to the iPhone 13 Pro Max. And it could take a few seconds depending on how much data you have on the older device or the Android device. But as you can see right here, things from music, ringtones, uh, videos. We also have bookmarks, contacts, calendar events. We also have attachments for messages and also notes, calls and call history reminders. I mean, the list of data that you can transfer is a lot. And I'm just gonna go ahead and select here the photos and the podcast just for the purpose of this video. It could take longer for you depending on the data, but again, you can select any type of data or all data here. I'm just gonna go with two types of data just for the purpose of the video to make the process quick. So you'll see the photos transfer as you can see right there, the transfer process in terms of photos and also podcasts is fairly quick as you can see right here in just a few seconds, the process will be completed. If I go into my iPhone, there is the camera roll with all the images from this iPhone over to the newer iPhone. Again, same process for Android devices for all types of data that we just mentioned. It's a super easy process, super easy software to use. Again, highly recommend any trans links will be in the description. If you're looking to transfer your data from an Android device to an iPhone, this is the best way to go about it or from an older iPhone to a new one as well. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.